Hej, siamano wam wszystkim ludzie, z tej strony Arturo, witam was na swoim kanale i kontynuujemy Broken Sword The Smoking Mirror. Dotarliśmy do Queramonte, a dokładnie na targowisko. Co ciekawe, znajdziemy tutaj też naszych przyjaciół z poprzednich części, jak i następnych. Pewnie wiecie już o kogo chodzi, ale dobra, rozejrzyjmy się, mamy kobietę. Kobietę, która handluje warzywami. Those things are gourds, aren't they? See. Hey, mind the footwear, lady. <laughs> Napluła mu na buty. Mamy kolejnego człowieka i kolejnych ludzi. A, widzę, że Niko się tam rozgląda wszędzie. Hi. You wanna buy something? Uh, no, not really. I got cabbages. Buy a cabbage, senor. I don't think so. I didn't come all this way to buy vegetables. Ale może wiesz coś na temat tej figurki? Have you ever seen anything like this before? Aj, Tetskatlopoka. Put it away, senor. Tetskatlopoka brings nothing but evil. The poor guy was so freaked, he didn't even mention his cabbages. Okej, okay, mamy figurkę, która przyciąga zło. Listen. Have you heard of Condor Trans Global? No. Buy a cabbage. I'll give you a discount on bulk purchases. I'm not in the cabbages. See ya. No dobra. Kolejna kobieta, z którą możemy porozmawiać. Kolejny człowiek. Dobra, zanim pójdziemy na prawo, oprzejmy sobie wszystko, co znajduje się po lewej stronie. Ale zapewne też się z nią nie dogadamy. Hi. Lovely bread. Que? Bread. Uh, pan? Si, pan. Uh, maybe I'll come back later when I'm hungry. Dobra. Dalej na lewo, tak czy inaczej iść nie możemy. Hi there. Uh, what have you got for sale? Que? I said, what have you got? Oh, never mind. George, troszeczkę lekcji hiszpańskiego by ci się przydało. Na pewno by te rozmowy o wiele łatwiej ci przychodziły i byś więcej rozumiał. Ale dobra, widzę, że mamy jakiś plakat, na górze jakiś strażników i kolejnego człowieka, który handluje rybami. To są ryby, tak? Do you have crabs? No, only fish. Okay, czy on też będzie przerażony, kiedy pokażemy mu tego bożka? Do you recognize this statue? Si, senor. It is very, very bad luck. That is Tezcatlipoca, the night hunter. I know, but I don't believe in luck, good or bad. You may not now, but you will. The guy looked scared out of his wits. Go away! Okay, czyli dopóki mamy tą figurkę, ludzie niechętnie z nami chcą rozmawiać. Mamy kozę. No, George już miał w poprzedniej części do czynienia z jedną kozą. Zapewne nie przepada za tymi zwierzątkami. Ale mamy tutaj Per. George Scobard, well of all the... Mrs. Henderson. Boy, this is some coincidence, huh? When you've been married to a fruitcake like Dwayne as long as I have, you stop believing in coincidence. I'd met Pearl and Dwayne on the other side of the globe in Syria. He was an army veteran who suspected he was working for the CIA. But wasn't sure. She was less obviously deranged. Oh, zobaczcie ile mamy tematów do rozmów. Take a look at this news cutting, Pearl. You'll have to read it to me, George. I left my specs in a gay bar in Santa Barbara. Well, it's about an eclipse of the sun, which is due to occur in a few weeks' time. You'd think the government would warn us about these kind of things. Ah, uh, ah, it's not dangerous or anything. Apparently, the best place to view the eclipse is right here in Cuaramonte. Oh, my. She didn't appear to be the slightest bit interested. Ale mogę się założyć, że Per będzie chciała tego bożka. Ona lubi takie artefakty. Ale możemy też pokazać jej robaczka. Look at this, Pearl. A tequila worm. Don't you bring that thing anywhere near me, honey. I swear I'll scream like a hog on a hot plate. <laughs> Czyli per nasz robaczek się nie podoba. No dobra. What do you make of this statue, Pearl? Ooh, that's a spitting image of Dwayne's brother Sheridan. A little less body hair maybe, but it's him all right. 
nie jest zainteresowana. What does this mean to you, Pearl? What cute little feathers. Why, if you had two of those, they'd sure make nice earrings. This isn't intended for frivolous personal adornment, Pearl. It's a dart, tipped with a fast-acting, muscle-numbing poison. Pardon me, I stand corrected, honey. Sometimes I got the feeling that communication with Pearl was like sending signals out into space. Maybe, if you waited long enough, you'd get an intelligent answer back. But it was a long shot. Ale ten kamyczek na pewno jej się spodoba. What do you make of this stone, Pearl? Oh, that's pretty. What's that thing supposed to be, a rabbit? I believe it's a coyote. Well, it sure is cute. I was surprised she didn't ask me where she could buy one. Nie wiem dlaczego, ale ja na tym kamieniu widziałem ptaka, nie wiem, sokoła, jastrzębia, coś takiego. What brings you to Quaramonte, Pearl? What takes me just about anywhere. The market. You drove 2,000 miles to go shopping? Shopping is my role in the economy of the great design, George. Is Dwayne here with you, Mrs. Henderson? Why, sure, I couldn't leave him home alone. Since Dwayne came back from the war, we couldn't bear to be apart. So, where is he now? We ain't speaking. Oi, pokucili się. Why aren't you speaking to Dwayne? Because he's an old spoiled sport sarapus. I want to visit one of those old pyramid places, but Dwayne says he has to stay in town. Right, and you don't want to go on your own. Well, there's no point in going to the pyramid if there's no one around to take my picture. Is Dwayne still working for the CIA? If he is, he doesn't know it. He's what they call a snoozer. Uh, don't you mean a sleeper? No, this is different. He used to think he worked for them, but the psychotherapy cured him of that. What he doesn't realize is that now he really does work for them. At least that's the way I understood it. Okay. Catch you later, Pearl. Czyli prawdopodobnie będziemy musieli przekonać Dwayna, żeby pojechał zwiedzić piramidy. Mamy grajków. Hey, cheer up, guys. What's with the long faces? Our pipe player has been arrested and thrown in jail. Poor Miguel. He never broke the law in his life. Miguel trafił do więzienia. No dobra. Do you guys know anything about a total eclipse? What is it? It's like when the sun is hidden by the moon. It's crazy. My cousin Alfredo swears he saw it happen once. But that was after he stupidly consumed a cocktail of peyote and antibiotics. Take a look at the design on this label. I have seen that before. Where? There was a ship flying a flag just like that. When did you see this ship? Three months ago. It was here, at the docks. Okay. What do you make of this little worm? No good. It's dead. Sure it's dead. You think I'd carry it around in my pocket if it wasn't? Dobra, wiecie co? Na razie sobie tą opcję dialogową pominiemy, porozmawiamy na resztę tematów, a na samym końcu wybierzemy Bożka, bo boję się, że kiedy wybiorę go teraz, no to nie będziemy mogli porozmawiać na tę resztę. Have you any idea what this is? No, senor. Me neither. Would either of you guys care for a biscuit? A dog biscuit, senor? Are you trying to insult us? No, really, they're good. We'll take your word for it. Why don't you try playing a tune to cheer yourselves up? No, we should be looking for real jobs. We could earn ten times as much down the mines. My cousin Ramirez was earning eight pesos an hour. Before he lost his legs in the accident. Oy, stracił obie nogi. Tell me about the accident at the mine. There was an explosion at Teokulkan. Thirty miners were buried alive. They got some of them out, though. Two of them, including your cousin, and they left half of him behind. Why was Miguel put in jail? For playing folk music. What? It's true, senor. He insisted on playing traditional Cuaramonte music, even though it's illegal. Pierwszy słyszę, żeby muzyka ludowa była gdziekolwiek zabroniona. What was the ship with the condor flag carrying? I don't know, senor. We weren't allowed near the docks. That's right. 
Usually we meet the ships when they tie up. We play to the tourists. Well, when the Condor ship came in, we were told to go away. No, dobra, i pozostał ten nieszczęsny Bożek. Have you seen anything like I, the hungry chief? Why are you carrying that thing around with you, senor? Don't you know who it is? Sure, it's Tez Catlipoca. But it's only a little carving. It brings death, senor. Death and destruction. Muszę to pamiętać. Muszę pamiętać, że przynosi śmierć i częściej zapisywać stan gierki. No dobra, George, zobacz, twoja stara przyjaciółka, koza. Now, I like most animals, but experience had made me wary of goats, and cats, and dogs. <laughs> I wszystkiego, co porusza się na czterech łapach. Okej, okay. weszliśmy na piętro. Ogólnie to chciałem spojrzeć na plakat. Kim jest ta przepiękna, rudowłosa kobieta? Hola, señora. Hi, we were wondering. I was talking to the lady, chico. Hi, my name is Nicole Collard. Concha Garcia, how can I help you, sister? The corporation I represent is considering a major investment in Cuaramonte. Your advice, as the head of an obviously successful concern, is precisely what I'm after. My assistant, Mr. Stobart, has a few questions he'd like to ask you. No, dobra. Majteczki, tak? Ja myślę, że to nie jest odpowiednia chwila i odpowiedni moment, żeby to pokazywać. Have you heard about the forthcoming eclipse? I don't take much interest in things like that. One of the boys might know about it. Okay. Do you recognize the icon on this label? Condor Transglobal. Did the company operate here in Caramonte? Yes, they ran an old container ship, the Mayan Princess. Boszka na razie nie będziemy pokazywać. Does this stone mean anything to you? I think it is a spirit stone carved by a Mayan priest, no? I don't know which of their many gods it represents. Może ciasteczko? Would you like a dog biscuit? Would you like a smack in the mouth, Chico? <laughs> Nie no, świetny tekst na podryw. Can you tell me about the accident at the mine? Accident? It was sabotage. Somebody wanted my mine closed down for good. Do you have any evidence that the mine was sabotaged? Not yet, but I'll get to the bottom of it. There'd been trouble at that mine for several months. The workforce was getting smaller every day. Someone had started a rumor among the men that the mine was cursed. Now the entire operation has been closed down. Where's the site of the mine? Several days upriver at a remote area known as Teokulkan. Okay. Have you heard of a man named Karzak? No, who is he? He's the reason we came to Cuaramonte. We think he's running a drug ring. Well, I hope you find him, but I've never heard the name before. Albo słyszała, ale go chroni. Do you know who owned Condor Transglobal? I have no idea. No dobra. Którą opcję wybrać? Majteczki czy Bożka? Majteczki. Would you be interested in these panties? They look about your size. Is that your best line, Chico? I'm serious. They were an unwanted gift. Put them away before you get overexcited. <laughs> Can you tell me anything about this statue? It is Tezcatlipoca, the god of death and pestilence. That fetish would be considered by many to be a bad omen. Okay. Pogadaliśmy na wszystkie tematy. Mamy też sekretarza. Możemy zajrzeć do szafki, tak? I kolejnych sekretarzy. Hi! Good afternoon and welcome to Consolidated Mining. If you are planning to stay in Cuaramante City, may I recommend the Consolidated Mining Experience, an interactive hands-on tour of one of our deepest mines, with talking tour guides available in three different languages. A tour of a mine. 
Well, this is a mining company. What else did you expect? Do you know where I could find Senor Karzak? No, Senor. Do you know anything about the eclipse that's due soon? Me? No, Senor. Nikt nic nie wie o zaćmieniu. No dobra, czy z tymi sekretarzykami też możemy porozmawiać? Ever heard of a guy called Karzak? No. Aha. Do you know anything about the eclipse? Yes. And I'm really looking forward to seeing it. I heard it's going to be pretty spectacular. It's in a few weeks time, isn't it? Nine days. Thanks. Za dziewięć dni dokładnie. Dobrze wiedzieć. Did you know there's an eclipse of the sun in a few weeks time? Yeah, Joe told me about it. He's having a party and we're all invited. Me and the boys are dressing up as evil monks. Yeah? Cool. Ever hear of a guy called Karzak? No, sir. I pozostał ostatni sekretarz. Ever heard of a guy called Karzak? Can't you see I'm busy? If I don't finish this stock report, the boss will be mad as hell. Are you looking forward to the eclipse of the sun? Not especially. Are you? I don't know. I've never seen one. All I know about eclipses is that you shouldn't try to view them with the naked eye. Please. Go away and let me get on with my work. No dobra. Ten był najmniej chętny do rozmowy. Możemy porozmawiać też z Nika, ale chętnie zajrzę do tej szafki. Chociaż coś mi się wydaje, że Conchita mi na to nie pozwoli. Keep out of there. No dokładnie. That's where the explosives are stored. Wow, materiały wybuchowe, dobrze wiedzieć. Niko? Co myślisz o tym wszystkim? Do you have any theories about this stone? I think that design represents a dog, a Mexican dog. So, this is the sacred Chihuahua stone? Sheesh. Take a look at this. Mon Dieu! Where did you get that kind of money? It's not mine. I found that statement at Ubier's house. Take a look at this. An eclipse of the sun. Why the sudden interest in astronomy? I found the cutting in Ubier's house. Apparently, it's only visible from Central America. Take a look at this, Nico. That's disgusting, George. Why are you carrying it around with you? I don't know. I just can't seem to part with it. Nigdy nie wiadomo, kiedy robaczek może się przydać. Guess what this is. Go on, guess. It's wrought iron, probably from a chimney stack on an old stove. Uh, well, I suppose it could be. How did she know that? My grandfather used to work in a foundry. Ah, widzisz, George. Chciałeś ją zaskoczyć, a to ona zaskoczyła ciebie. Okej. Okay. Czy Niko się skusi na ciasteczko? Would you like a biscuit? Gourmet dog? Have you been eating those things, George? Sure, they're great. <laughs> Labano tells me he's been seeing a lot of you. We meet sometimes for lunch, a drink. After you'd gone back to the States, I was pretty lonely, you know. Lonely? You must have been desperate. Couldn't you just visit the zoo or something? George, już nie bądź taki zazdrosny. No dobra, tu sobie wszystko sprawdziliśmy. Ale chcę obczaić jeszcze ten plakat. Kto się na nim znajduje? In Quaramonte, defacing a poster was probably a capital offense. It looked to me like an early portrait of Orson Welles. Orson Welles. Nie mam zielonego pojęcia, kim może być ten człowiek. No dobra, chyba nie pozostaje nic innego, jak wejść na posterunek policji i spróbować wyciągnąć tamtego kolesia z więzienia. Chyba, że znajdziemy gdzieś tu jeszcze Dwayna, no to z nim porozmawiamy. Dobra, mamy ciężarówkę. No jest Dwayne. It was Pearl's husband. Dwayne! Hey, Mr. Anderson! Good to see you again! Do I know you, son? George Stobart, remember? In Syria? 
I sold you a statue. I remember that. Pearl was mighty vexed when the paint came off. Look, I'm sorry. I'll give you back the $50. No, no. You suckered me fair and square. Hmm. What do you think of these panties, Dwayne? Lord! Hot stuff, George. You buy those for your girl? No. A guy we knew in Paris bought them for her. Oh. You're a threesome, then. Why are you looking at me like that, George? Forget it. Nie było tematu. Do you know anything about a shipping company called Condor Transglobal? Sure I do. You have to get up pretty early to catch Dwayne with his pants down. What? You beat me to it? Condor Transglobal is all wound up. Seems like my investigations scared them off. Would you like a biscuit, Dwayne? Oh, no. Those gourmet dog snacks bring me out in a rash. You've tried them? They were on special offer. Pearl bought a whole crate. When I asked her if she was thinking of keeping a dog, too, she just laughed. No tak, cała per. Kupuje wszystko po promocyjnych cenach. Nieważne, że to psie żarcie, kocie żarcie. Ważne, że promocja. Did you drive all the way down here? Hell no. Pearl did the driving while I followed the maps. The way she handled the wheel, you think she'd been trucking half her life. Why did you bring a huge truck like that? George, I'm on a top secret classified mission for Uncle Sam. This truck is a rolling bomb. 400 pounds of nitrate fertilizer with a plastic initiator. They'll hear the bang in China. Gee, I'm really looking forward to this. No dobra, czyli mamy tutaj materiały wybuchowe, tak? I spoke to Pearl earlier. Yeah? Did she mention that we had a kind of falling out? Yes, she did. She'll get over it. Did you know that traditional music is illegal in Caramonte? Is that so? Seems reasonable to me. No, really. The leader of the band in the square has been in prison just because of the music he played. I don't know who you've been talking to, but that fella, Miguel, he's an agitator. What's the real reason the musician was in prison? Handed out subversive literature at the mines. That so-called general was waiting for Miguel when he got back into town. Marched him off to jail at gunpoint on a charge of inciting a riot. Okay, no, czyli już wszystko wyjaśnia, dlaczego trafił do więzienia. Does the name Karzak mean anything to you? Sounds like a comic book villain to me, son. He's the man behind Condor, and the rat who kidnapped Nico. You know, the first time I met you, I was deeply impressed with your naive simplicity. I said to Pearl, if we ever had kids, I would have wanted a boy like George. But I underestimated you, son. <laughs> Are you still working for... you know who? You know I can't talk about my work, George. That's between me and Uncle Sam. Okay. Człowiek. Hi, I'm George Stobart. What do you think of these panties? Awesome. You wear them? Uh, no. Someone sent them to my girlfriend. Thoughtful. Have you heard about the eclipse of the sun? Sure. I'm having a party to celebrate it. Drop by. Really? Sure. Plenty of food, plenty of wine, and everyone's invited. Except the general. Aż mnie kusi, żeby udać się na tą imprezę. Jeżeli zaprasza, wszystko jest za darmo. A z racji, że my jesteśmy Polakami Januszami, no czemu by nie skorzystać? Do you recognize the design on this label? Why, sure. That's the Condor Transglobal Shipping Company logo. Do they have an office in Cuaramonte? No, but they ship out from here. That's what I thought. Can you tell me anything about this stone? That's obsidian. It's a volcanic rock which has cooled so fast that... Yeah, yeah, look, I'm not interested in geology. You're not. I suppose you want to know about the carved picture on it. That's right. Then the guy you should talk to is the professor. 
He was here a while ago. Okay. What can you tell me about the mining company? The general closed down one of their mines after the explosion. Lots of folks lost their lives. I was lucky. I only lost my legs. Did you see the ship with the condor flag? Mmm, no. But the dock is just the other side of the square. Might as well be the other side of the moon. Do you know what this statue represents? Should do. I used to carve things like that to sell to tourists. But it scared people around here, so I stopped. Czyli to ten gość robił takie figurki. Dobra, już wybrałem herbatniki, zapytamy się czy chce. He wouldn't be interested. Jednak nie. Czyli tak naprawdę pozostał nam tylko posterunek policji do odwiedzenia, bo tam dalej za miasto chyba iść się nie da. Okno celi. Czekaj, George, spójrz do okna. Czy tam znajduje się Miguel? There was a forlorn looking guy asleep on the floor of the jail. It was Miguel, the pipe player. Hey, Miguel! He didn't hear me. It was one of the Czy jest coś, co ja mogę zrobić, żeby odwrócić jego uwagę? Rzuciłbym mu robaka. Albo nie. Chodźmy na posterunek. Mimo wszystko. Hey, Nico! I have done just as I have been instructed, Professor. Professor? With the mine closed down, there'll be no one around to observe your excavations. Ah, I have visitors. Just remember what I told you, General. There's really no need to make a martyr out of that man. I'm sorry to keep you waiting, senor. Welcome to Quarmonte. Thanks. My name's George Stobart from California. But what is this? An angel come down to earth. Nicole Collard. Enchanté, mon général. Pardon me, senorita, but I couldn't help myself. Uh, look, we'd like to ask you a few questions. You've come to the right place, senor. Uh, tourist information. General Graciento, at your service. General Graciento, mam kilka pytań, na które chciałbym uzyskać odpowiedzi. Po kolei. Do you know anything about the forthcoming eclipse, general? Such things do not interest me, senor. Take a look at this label. Si, senor. Condor Transglobal. Can you tell me where to find their offices? No, senor. I never heard of them, and neither did Ronaldo. The lady at the mining company told us a ship belonging to Condor was here recently. Conchita Garcia is crazy. If there had been a ship, do you think I wouldn't have noticed? What do you think of these panties, General? Oh boy, fabuloso! They're yours if you'll tell me all you know about Karzak. Karzak? I never heard of him. Do I get the panties now? I told you all I know. You told me nothing. Zboczony gościu, jeszcze jak mu powiemy, że są to majtki Niko, na pewno wyśpiewa nam informacje. Ale poczekamy. Have you ever seen anything like this before? That's a native carving, isn't it? Where did you get it? We picked it up in the market, as a souvenir. Ciasteczko? Would you like a biscuit? Are you trying to bribe me? Well, every man has his price. Mine is more than a dog cookie, Senor Stobart. Co możesz powiedzieć na temat profesora? Who was the guy you were talking to when we arrived? Professor Ubie, a visitor, Senor, like yourselves. Did you say Ubie? Si, Senor. Professor Ubie, a French archaeologist. Gościu, którego szukamy. What's Ubie doing in Quaramonte? Researching our rich and glorious past, senor. The professor is planning an expedition to some Mayan ruins. He came to see me to get an excavation permit. 
Are there any ruins around the city? Of course, Signor. Guaramonte has everything. I have a friend who wants to visit an historical site. Reynaldo will only be too pleased to conduct a guided tour. When he's dealt with today's paperwork, of course. Is it true there's a restriction on music in Guaramonte? Yes, there is. An emergency measure introduced by Nuestra Senora. Folk music is a link with the past for some of these people. Take away their musical roots and what do they got left? Easy listening. You think easy listening could replace a musical heritage hundreds of years old? Why not? It happened in your country. I hear there was an accident at the mine a few months ago. That's correct. A lot of men killed, weren't there? A few. Thirty? <laughs> Barely one percent of the working population. This is the tourist office? It says police on the sign outside. It is both, senor. I am a man of many parts. I can see that, General. Are you sure you never heard of Condor? Oh, yes. The company is registered here, in Quaramonte City. You are mistaken, senorita. The musicians out in the square say that a ship flying the Condor flag was birthed here. They are simple peasants. They will go along with anything you say in the hopes of parting you from your money. Condor is run by Karzak, isn't it? Wrong again, senor. Karzak has nothing to do with anything called Condor. Whoever he is. Do you keep a record of companies registered in Quaramonte? Of course, senorita. Unfortunately, all the records were destroyed by a flash flood. No, dobra. I'll be back. Jeszcze wrócimy. Mamy papierki. I had no need for junk mail, especially someone else's. A couple of special offer letters were strewn across the desk. Telewizor. The television was showing what appeared to be a low-budget soap. A tall man with long blonde hair was shouting at a woman who was naked apart from a towel. Pewnie jakiś teledysk. It was a computer monitor with some kind of outdated game displayed on it. Dobra, tutaj jest ta mapka, którą oglądali razem z profesorkiem. Senor! Leave that chart alone. Czyli będziemy musieli znaleźć inny sposób, żeby obejrzeć tą mapkę. Mamy Ronaldo. Ronaldo, Ronaldo. Hi! I'm George Stobart. Hello, senor. How can I help you? You know anything about this eclipse? No, senor. El General keeps me in the dark about most things. Okay. Would you like a gourmet dog snack biscuit? I would love one, senor. But I would have a problem with my teeth. Toothache? No, senor. If the general catches me eating on duty, he'll knock them out. No to trzeba się generała pozbyć z tego komisariatu. Are there any ancient pyramids near Quaramonte? Si, senor. But it's not very impressive. It's in ruins. That's perfect. Would you be willing to give a guided tour of the ruins? I can't. The general would have a fit if I left all this paperwork. I'd like to visit your prisoner. Condemned prisoners aren't allowed visitors. Condemned? To death. He is to be executed. Knowing my luck, I will probably have to shoot him myself. Amnesty International is going to hear about this. I thought Miguel was arrested for playing the wrong kind of music. Si, senor, he was. And that carries the death penalty? No, no, no. You think we're crazy? While being questioned, he confessed to being an anti-government agent. What the chicava? Do you recognize this statue? There's Catlipoca. The night wind. Take it away, senor. That stone is cursed. Wszyscy boją się tego bożka. So long. A my tak po prostu nosimy go w kieszeni. I wasn't going to try investigating the passage while the general was sat there. Dobra, może Niko w jakiś sposób będzie mogła odwrócić uwagę generała. I wasn't going... That man we saw talking to the general was Ubie. Didn't you recognize him? I never met him, remember? The guy I called in Paris claimed to be Ubier, but he sounded nothing like the man in the police station. 
Maybe the professor really is innocent. Nah, it's too much of a coincidence that he's here in Quaramonte. Czyli co, musimy wejść na zewnątrz i go odnaleźć, tak? Gdzie mógł iść profesorek? Why did you show him the stone? I thought maybe he might know something about it. Well, he does now, for sure. He knows we have it. You came on a little strong with the general. I was merely flattering his ego, Georges. Every man has his Achilles heel. Maybe, but that guy's weakness isn't in his foot. Did you notice that chart on the police station wall? Yes, it looked like a map to me, but I couldn't make out the details. Whatever it was, the general didn't want us to see it. Dlatego proszę ci, Niko, odwróć jego uwagę. There was no... I hear you drove all the way to Quaramonte. In a truck. That's right. You would not believe the state of some of those roads. Makes me damn right sad to think there's still some places you can't reach in an automobile. In this day and age, you'd think there'd be decent highways just about anywhere folk choose to go. Did you know that the truck was full of explosives? Whatever gave you that idea, as if I couldn't guess. Your husband. He was exaggerating, wasn't he? Sometimes I wonder how I'm gonna cope with Dwayne's over-fertile imagination. <laughs> Have you met the guy who calls himself the General? No, I haven't. Is he a real general? I guess so. He wears a lot of medals on his chest. The wrong side of his chest. At least, for any army I'd ever seen. Catch you later, Pearl. A mi się wydaje, że to nie jest prawdziwy generał. Po prostu przypisał sobie taki przydomek, żeby rządzić. Okay, mamy Ubiera. Professor Ubier? Yes. Who are you? My name is Stobart. George Stobart. Wow, ile tematów. Take a look at this, Professor. What have you got to say about that? Where did you get this? Never mind that. How do you explain these withdrawals? I left my financial affairs in the hands of my secretary. Including the withdrawal of funds in cash from your personal account? I trust Gwyneth implicitly. And why Marseille? Why the very place my girlfriend was taken? That's obvious, Stobart. We are both the victims of the same devious plot. You know, what plot? I have no idea. Do you know anything about this eclipse, Professor? Of course. It's not the reason I'm here in Quaramonte, but I'm looking forward to seeing it all the same. Jestem ciekaw, czy dożyję takich czasów, że nad Polską będzie całkowite zaćmienie słońca. Ja wiem, że można to sprawdzić w internecie, są tam jakieś obliczenia i tak dalej, i tak dalej. Ale nie chcę mi się tego robić. I tak pewnie nie dożyję. Do you see this label? Yes. It refers to a company named Condor. What of it? I traced that company here to Quaramonte. Do you know where I can find the offices of Condor Transglobal? The company no longer exists. They went bankrupt recently. I have proof that you are directly involved with Condor. I used them as shippers to transport artifacts to a gallery in Paris. Beyond that, I have no connection with the company, which, as I said, no longer exists. Ach tak, no co powiesz na temat tego Boszka? Can you identify this statue, Professor? Oh yes. Tezcatlipoca, the Lord of Darkness. A Central American god, right? A supreme deity. Tezcatlipoca means, literally, smoking mirror. There. You see the mirror shield in his left hand? The Mayans believed he could look into the mirror and see into the hearts of men. He was the wind which came howling in the night in search of victims. And victims they gave him by the thousand. Human sacrifices? Men, women, children, animals, anything that bled. The steps of his temple ran red with the blood of sacrifices. The Mayans have a legend that says he'll return one day. I hope I'm not around to see it. Can you tell me anything about this stone? Where did you get that? This is the stone my girlfriend called you about. The stone that nearly cost Nico her life. I assure you, I don't know what you're talking about. A, czyli Niko nie rozmawiała z profesorem Ubierem. 
Czyli musiała rozmawiać z Karzakiem. Hmm, to by wyjaśniało, dlaczego została porwana. Would you like a biscuit? No, thank you. You should, they're good. Hmm, I can't get enough of these things. <laughs> Psie ciasteczko zjadł. Have you ever employed a Central American butler or servant? I've never employed any kind of servant, monsieur. What are you doing in Caramante, professor? Seeking Mayan artifacts. Central American history has been my life's work. What do you know about my girlfriend's abduction? I don't know what you're talking about. She was invited to your mansion in Paris. Not by me, she wasn't. I haven't been home for nearly seven months. Arrivederci. Tell me about your wife, professor. Please, I... I don't want to talk about her. Czy ją zastrzelił? Maybe you don't, but I do. Why was she known as the Little Dachshund? It was just a silly pet name I used to call her. Somehow some damned reporter found out. Does the name Karzak mean anything to you? Yes, I know him. In fact, if it wasn't for Karzak, I wouldn't be here. What? He's financing my expedition. What's your interest in the eclipse, Professor? Oh, it's purely a layman's curiosity. History is my subject, not astronomy. But I've been fascinated by the movements of the heavenly bodies since I was a child. I wouldn't miss a total eclipse for the world. Does the eclipse have some special significance for you? For me? No. For the ancient Mayans, it marked the end of the fifth age. Perhaps we should be celebrating. Ah, no. The end of each age heralds destruction on a global scale. The fifth is the final age, ending in the total destruction of the Earth. Ok, pogadaliśmy na wszystkie tematy. Czyli to wszystko wyjaśnia. Karzak sprowadził tutaj profesora Ubiera, żeby prowadził badania nad cywilizacją Majów. Dlaczego? No bo tak, my też mamy ten kamień. To wszystko jest powiązane ze sobą. Do you think the general was involved with Condor? Hell no. And if he's a general, I'm a Buddhist. No, that fella's just a mouthpiece for the real power in Quaramonte. So the general is nothing but a pup? He's like Pinocchio before he met the Blue Rinse Fairy. Strictly strings and wood. Who's pulling the strings? His mother. Better known as La Presidenta, the dictator. Dobra. It was one of the There was a forlorn looking guy asleep on It was Miguel, the pipe player. Dobra, moi kochani, jeszcze troszeczkę rzeczy mamy w Quaramonte do zrobienia, ale zajmiemy się tym w kolejnym odcinku, ponieważ ten już trwa prawie 40 minut. Tak więc ja się z wami żegnam. Dzięki wielkie za uwagę. Trzymajcie się i do usłyszenia. Piona!